i would say perseverance is the key you have to be dedicated to the subject you love it is all about passion in the end uh, i have been with speed for around 6 months initially i used the high yield series videos uh, they were very useful for revision and uh, videos mostly covered the tables part of kelly and hoshberg i also would like to thank the speed uh, faculty and speed platform doctor i bring in all the wishes and greetings to dr vinita for scoring rank number 1 in dm rheumatology in any ss session april 2024 thank congratulations you. to you doctor thank you very much sir doctor can you tell us a brief background from where you come from where you started your career and what all you have done so far ah oh, yes sir uh, i am uh, dr vinita i am from guntur andhra pradesh i have completed my mbbs from aims bhubneshwar and i completed my md internal medicine from pgi chandigarh great career already built and <laughs> it is the super specialty completion phase now this rank will get you where you wanted where you are planning to take up your rheumatology dm rheumatology i want to take in pj chandigarh sir i have been waiting for this only since one year very nice very nice we are very happy for you we are very happy for you, you. and uh, can we know what all you did to achieve this career and to achieve this rank even before that why your special interest for rheumatology so i am a uh, medicine person i like internal medicine a lot i don't want to deviate from the uh, medicine as such so choosing a specialty was very difficult for me initially uh, i was thinking uh, hematology at first uh, then i thought i am more of a family person too and hematology kinds of brings the patients uh, emotions and all to home and i didn't want that happening though i still like hematology as a subject but practically i thought i better fit in rheumatology and for my love of medicine i thought uh, rheumatology will be just like an extension like dm in medicine so i chose rheumatology perfect perfect you decided rheumatology to go on and you yes. and you wanted only a topmost rank to choose where you wanted yes the sir number of seats are limited yes. now what did you do for that i mean how did you plan meticulously to achieve we want rank number 1 you got it and how did you conceive that and how did you work towards it so first of all i have a uh, very good support from my seniors so they have guided me very well uh, so initially i thought i will start reading textbook only because since beginning i was always concept oriented and i want to read the uh, chapters first then only uh, go for any shortcuts or uh, notes or anything like that so i started reading kelly last time i could not complete all of the kelly part uh, only major uh, uh, topics i could read like uh, major uh, topics like rheumatoid arthritis sle jogrens scleroderma only major topics i could read but this time i tried to finish as much as possible uh, and i make notes for myself from kelly it's not like uh, every chapter notes but when i read a chapter and i i simultaneously do questions either uh, from speed or from another platform wherever i do the questions i recognize which areas i am weak at like which areas i am uh, feeling i have not strengthened my concepts that is why i am forgetting things so i write down those things and when i read next time i remember better when i read it from my own handwriting great doctor so did you go through all the videos in the app i watched all the high yield series videos Uh, because they covered almost all the tables and it was like a quick revision uh, then i watched some uh, topics which i thought i am making too many mistakes like systemic sclerosis and myositis and immunodeficiency disorders and rest of the things i used the notes from the uh, pdf now how many questions did you give in this exam i attempted 79 sir oh maximum number of questions <laughs> now how did you prepare the general medicine part of it we did you our focus was on only super specialty focus was mainly on super specialty but at the same time uh, since i have given the last two inss also i uh, have kind of an idea which topics are focused on general medicine so those topics i used to read from harrison and do some questions from the question bank okay doctor what was your uh, interview experience what did you do I mean what all they asked I mean how you have to manage that as well right 
So, I mean, uh, what what did you do for that? Can you share some of the experience for that? Interview, the main thing I would say is we have to be cool. Uh, like there are there were so many questions asked. Like uh, there were around six panelists and everyone have asked the questions. So it, we have to be with a cool mind. And it's not just rheumatology. There is also medicine part in the interview also. So there are some medicine questions and rheumatology questions. I prepared mostly for rheumatology only for the interview. I didn't know medicine questions also will be there. Then uh, medicine background knowledge is okay, uh, fair enough for me. So I could do most of it. Great, doctor. It is uh, time to advise students who are aspiring for DM rheumatology. What do you want to tell them? Those who are preparing for it. I would say perseverance is the key. You have to be dedicated to the subject you love. It is all about passion in the end. There is only one seat. Everyone knows that. And it is a very stressful situation when there is so much competition for just one seat uh, or two or three seats. So if you want in a particular college of your choice and that is very limited opportunity that is available, you have to put in your full efforts and it should be consistent. And I think it is possible. Uh, even I used to think it's only one seat. Uh, how how am I going to do it? But one seat is all that is required. Okay, doctor. How long you have been with uh, Speed? And what is your experience of the content which are there in Speed? Why are they I mean, appropriate for this exam? Can you tell us something on that? Uh, I have been with Speed for around six months. Five to, five to six months. Initially, I used the high yield series videos. Uh, they were very useful for revision and uh, videos mostly covered the tables part of Kelly and Hoshberg. So that is uh, good. Time to thank and whom all you want to thank. You can use this platform to thank them. Uh, first of all, I would like to thank my parents. Like, they have done everything for me uh, in my life. Uh, this is only a small thing I can do for them. Uh, they are very happy with this as well. And I also would like to thank God uh, for giving me the strength to go through all the ups and downs through, throughout my preparation and stay consistent and finally achieve what I dreamt for. I also would like to thank my teachers and my seniors and my, my friends who are all a big support. I also would like to thank the Speed uh, faculty and uh, all the platform team, Speed platform. Great, Doctor. Nice to have you uh, in this interview session today. We once thank again you. wish you all the best and all the success to have a great career in DM Rheumatology. And, and you have achieved something. Everyone wants this and you have achieved it. And you are standing as a very big role model to all the students. And uh, we wish you a great career ahead. All the best and all the success. You used to come as a great rheumatologist in making. And going to serve millions of people and people are going to be happy with you. All the best. Thank you, sir. Thank, Thank you very much. You.